Hey you. Looking good today? Yeah. Hey guys, welcome back. So you know how I said that I was going on like a low buy for 2015? I suck at life. So yeah, I have a haul, a drugstore haul. I did get some clearance things and I did get some good deals on some things. But it's a haul. So yeah, let's just get to it. It's mainly lip products. Products? Do I say that weird? Which is ridiculous. So I don't even know what came from where. It's all just like thrown into this bucket. Let's let's show you something. I'm just going to grab things out of here. The first thing is this Rimmel Kate Scandalized Mascara by Kate Moss in I Rock Jet Black. I don't know what that means. Like, I Rock, E-Y-E Rock. I don't know what that means. And the wand intrigued me on this because I'm using the, I have a sample of the Lancome Hypnose Drama and the wand is kind of similar to that and I love it. Like, I love that mascara. So I'm really hoping that this $6 version is comparable because I don't want to spend $30 on the mascara. That's insane. Like, I just wouldn't. That's insane. Okay, it's sorted now. We'll at least go ahead and order by, like, eye products or whatever. So I got this at TJ Maxx. It's from Too Faced, and it's a glitter glaze sparkling shadow top coat. And I've never heard of this, and it intrigued me. So I got it. It was four fifty, And it's just like a glitter glaze top coat. Ew, gross. Mm. Look how funky that looks. This is why I hate buying makeup at TJ Maxx because, and I stupidly didn't look at the tube before I bought it, but maybe it'll be okay. It's just like a sheer gold top coat. Like, it's like a gold top coat for your eyes. I don't know, I thought it was cool. It's called Goldie Rocks. So we'll see. The next eye things I got were from, who knows, I don't know, probably Walgreens. Uh, the, this one was on clearance, I don't know why, but it's the Rimmel Scandalized Eyeshadow Stick in Gossip Green. It's just a lovely green, like, you guys know I love green and blue. And it's just really lovely, it's very creamy, and it was like two bucks. So I was like, you're coming home with me in Gossip Green? And then they have a new one called Naughty Navy. Uh -huh. These don't come sealed, which bugs me, but whatever. And it's just a really pretty navy. Oh, I bet you this gold would look great over either of those colors. <laughs> uh, and then when I was at the Dollar Tree last week, they have like Maybelline makeup at the Dollar Tree. They have, and I bought three of them, and I can't find the blue one in it. Like, I kind of think I just. It, they like left it at the counter at the Dollar Tree and they only charged me for it and I forgot to call. But it's the Maybelline Master Smoky Eye Studio. This one is an Emerald Fury and Smoldering Violet. And then I got the blue, like the navy one. I don't have that, which is dumb, but they're just like crayons, you know, twist up crayons. There's a smudge thing on this end. There's a smudgy. And Um, so this is a really lovely green. It's, it's a very dark green. It's right there. It almost looks black. But it is green. And then the last one is one of the new L'Oreal Infallible Eye Crayons. I got this at Walgreens the other day. And I was kind of annoyed. They told me that the, because it was a new product, like all of the L'Oreal products were buy one get one half off. Like almost all of them because I was standing there at the beauty counter and I turned behind and like the whole wall was just like bound going half off, bound going, like all the stickers were bound going half off. And so I said to the lady, like, aren't they supposed to be having going half off? And she said, no, because it's a new product. And I was like, that's not any fun. Whatever. Um, so I just got one. This is Resilient Green and it is gorgeous. 
Oh my gosh, that green is so beautiful. I I want to just like paint my whole face that color green. So pretty. So pretty. New Wet n Wild Fergie blushes. I grabbed. There's three new blushes. I grabbed two of them. Ooh. Clearly, I haven't opened them yet. Oh, I'm jacking up my nails here. You know. I wouldn't think I would do this ahead of time. Okay. You would think. Okay, so this is Wet n Wild's Fergie Blush in Brush with Danger. It is a matte, bright pink. Ooh, it's very soft. It's a little powdery, but... Oh, it's very soft, I mean. That is Brush with Danger, and then this is Brush with Destiny. We're brushing all over the place. Come on, why? Why? I hate that. Make a sticker that pulls off evenly. It is 2015, people. Okay, and this is just a, it's a little bit shimmery, kind of a, nude color. This is weird. These are like, like there's an air bubble in here or something. Now this will be really pretty in the summer, I think. So I got those two. Let's wipe that off before we get pink blush everywhere. Um, and then, guys, I bought my first foundation the other day. I've never owned a foundation. Are you, like, proud of me? I got the new Maybelline Fit Me Matte Plus Poreless for normal to oily. I'm not sure. I got the color Natural Ivory, which I think is okay. I don't know. But I'm not sure oh, wait, 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 about this because I've heard a lot of people say, like, if you have a dry skin at all, like, just don't even bother. And... I don't have a lot of dry skin, but I do have some, so I'm kind of scared to use this. Also, I'm scared just because it's funny. And then I got three nail polishes, and then the rest are all lip products. I got this guy at the Dollar Tree. Uh, hello, throwback, Maybelline Express Finish in the color Chocolate Grape. I used it, like, this used to be my jam not this color specifically, but this, like, brand. I had so many of these, and I was like, I partially bought it just for the nostalgia. <laughs> but, that's pretty about it. and it's pretty cool. And then at Kmart, I grabbed some that were on clearance. This is the Sally Hansen Complete Salon Manicure Vintage Confetti. It's, like, black and gold and pink glitter, and it was, it says 374, but it was dollar eighty seven or something. So I mean these are like eight bucks normally. Yeah, I needed that. And then I grabbed the Nicole by OPI gumdrops in Anise Treat. Anise Treat. Anise. Get it? A nice treat. This is a dollar forty nine. Yeah. I, uh, are you guys like this? Do you leave price tags on things? Because I cannot. Like, once I'm, I've got the product home and it's like, I know it's like living with me, you know? I cannot leave the price tag on things. It drives me insane. This at Kmart as well. This is one of the Rimmel matte, no, not matte, lip lacquers in the color Nova. Which, you know what I mean? I might own this color, so I don't know if I'm... Well, whatever. But it was $1.49. I can't... I just can't say no. But... These smell like lipstick, but it's a very pretty... Pink. It's like a rosy pink. So I got that one. And then also at Kmart, the Rimmel Lasting Finish Color Rush 
long lasting color bomb. Blah blah blah. In the color uh, Boom Chicka Boom. This was two bucks. You guys know how I feel about my chubby lip crayons. And it's a little bit sheer, so I kind of like that. And it smells like vanilla. So that's good. Probably have 14 colors like that already. Also from Kmart, while we're on the clearance train, this is the Rimmel by Kate, or Last and Finish by Kate Lipstick in the color number 110. And this is like an orangey, an orangey red color, kind of. Kind of like a tomato orangey red. It's like a little bit different for me, too. You know, I like pinks and blush and like rose colors so it's a little bit different for me to have like orange that's on top of uh i grabbed uh some more rimmel by kate i believe i got one of these at walgreens actually i got both of them at walgreens and they're both on clearance as well number 101 just like a blushy nude And number 109, which is very similar to this. It's like the sh well, it's the shade below this 110 color. It's more like a, a burnt orangey color. You know, what else? I don't know. Um, and then I did grab one more of the Milani Matte Lipsticks. This is number 66 Passion. I'm like feeling orange right now, apparently. This is pretty much identical, almost identical to the other ones, but it's this little one. I just am feeling orange. I don't know. And they're so, these are so, like, creamy. I love these. Wet n Wild has some new lipsticks as well, and I already purchased a couple others that are in my bathroom and I didn't throw in here. And I'm not going to grab them because... But I grabbed three more because they're 99 cents. Oh my gosh. Okay, and this one is number 539A Cherry Frost. Let's go down here. Oh wow. It's like much more pink than it looks in the tube. Like it looks like straight up red and that it's like pink. Cherry Frost, and I don't love the caps on these because you have to be really careful when you're putting them on. And it's like this, like, shaped bottom, so it has to go in a specific, like, spot on the... I don't love that. This one is number 571, 15 minutes of flame. It's a bright pink. Hold on. Who's on Memento? Bright pink. Just, just going balls to the wall here with this. Oh, it's not as bright as it looks. It looks like straight up neon. It's it's not that bright. Well, I mean, it's bright, but not like... Whoa! And the last one is 503, will you be, 503C, will you be with me? What is, I don't know what the numbers on the back of these mean, or the end of the, I don't know what the letters mean, is what I mean to say. Find the numbers. 503C, will you be with me? And that is, ooh, like a dusty pink. I like that one. Straight up downtown and evening. I don't know why that song just popped into my head. I did grab two of the new CoverGirl lip... What are they? CoverGirl lip lavas? I don't know why, because I don't really feel like, I don't like these, but some I just was seeing so much stuff about them. I was like, I need to get one. And they were buying me one half off, so I couldn't just get one. That would be stupid. Um... 
Okay, so this is... what are you? Oh, uh, look, it's lava. I like the French's. Regardez. De la la. Oh wait, maybe that's Spanish. I'm not sure. Oh my gosh, these are so crazy. So crazy bright. But it's a really pretty blue toned, blue shimmer. It's so pretty! And then number 820, Mango Lava. And it's straight up orange, again. Like, I don't know what I'm thinking, but. Ooh. No, these don't really smell that good. Holy balls. Oh my gosh, okay. Yeah, that's straight up orange. Like, I probably will return that one. That's... That's... I mean, it's just straight up orange. I guess I thought it would be a little more sheer. I don't know that. Today, while well, I was at Target, or, you know, whatever day, I... Today when I'm coming. Whatever day I post this. I don't know. I had a 20% off Pacifica coupon, and I've never tried any Pacifica, like, makeup. I've gotten, like, eyeshadows in my Ipsy bags. But I wanted to try one of these lip tints, and this is the Blood Orange Lip Tint. The packaging is just so pretty. Ooh, it smells delicious, too. It smells like the orange. And it's, like, super sheer, but that's okay. Like, it's super sheer. I'm okay with that, though. Just wear this bright ass orange <laughs> lip gloss over it. <laughs> but I mean, look how cute the packaging is. It's so pretty. Then while that Rite Aid a couple of weeks ago, I saw these CoverGirl Last Flip Stick duos, and they were on clearance. I think they were a dollar forty nine each, and I was like, I was having like, I've been really emotional lately. We just had a lot of stuff going on, and so I've just been like. I need makeup. Like, <laughs> doing a lot of, like, emotional shopping. Which is a terrible idea, but that's what I was doing. So I got number 815, Flashy, 835, Cheeky, and 805, Pucker. And I'm not going to swatch all of these because there's six of them, and these are not new. They're clearancing them out, so... But I guess you just put, like, one side. You can, like, mix the colors and stuff. I just thought it was... Because, you know, I don't have a lot of lip products. Alright, one more thing from L'Oreal, and then I have some things from Jordana. This is the Infallible Pro Matte Gloss. I don't understand what that means, but I was intrigued. And this is color 512 Fuchsia Amnesia. And I started opening it the other day, and then I was like, no, stop. Because it, can you see how it's clear in the so you can see like look at all that product well maybe okay. so I'm I don't get how this is a matte gloss unless it's just like a satin actually yeah it is kind of like satin I mean we'll let it sit there for a minute but BAM that's pink it's like in your face in your face Guys, I'm so weird today. I'm sorry. I don't know what's wrong with me. So, yeah, I mean, that's like... Okay. And then I grabbed four of the Jordana Twist and Shines, which I'm not actually going to swatch because I'm going to do a separate video about these. So, um, I grabbed four of them. You'll see them in a video. So that was my ridiculous, stupid haul. You know, no no buy 2015s or low buy 2015s going really well. Just really well. I fail, but it's okay. Because everything's so great! Um, thank you guys so much for watching. Leave me a comment down below if you've tried any of these products or anything you want to leave me a comment on, really. Uh, thank you guys so much for watching, and I will talk to you soon. Bye!